That's very loud. I'm gonna turn that down. We'll turn it back up when I'm gonna adjust the sound, but Jesus, that's loud. You know what that silhouette means, y'all. It's Katamari Damashi time, baby. Shit is fucking loud, but it's so good. Hell yeah. That music goes hard, y'all. And look at this music video. How could I not include this? Are you kidding me? Oh, yeah. Hey, hey. The song goes hard, man. Holy crap. I just forgot how hard that song goes. God damn. Well, guys. Welcome to Katamari Damashi. Reroll. It's time for Funky to finally play this game in its entirety. Many years ago, I did do a one-off Wednesday of this game. And, you know, it's super fun. But, realistically, it's kind of limited in its gameplay mechanics. So, back in the day, I was just kind of like, eh, I'll do a one-off and that's fine. But, I did uh, end up playing this whole game on my own time. Now, not this version. This is the re-roll version. Also, don't play, the, don't play that again. As much as I love it, don't play it again. Um, as much as I, I had fun playing the PS2 version, I was just like, man, I feel like I should have recorded all that. So let's just, let's just play the re-roll version now that it exists, and I'm just gonna play the whole game. So let's press start and get this little intro thing out of the way. And right now I'm a little annoyed because I have to play this in a small window, but I'm gonna fix that as soon as I can. But ah, oh, hello, Prince. This is the King. Long time no see. We thought today would be a good day for rolling. The Katamari, the Prince. Where the first rolls, the second follows. Roll, roll, roll. For that purpose alone, we went to the bother, the bother of making this space. The king of all cosmos, going to the bother just for rolling a Katamari. Just for that, went to the bother. Yeah, King Cosmos, he's a fucking weirdo. Get ready to talk around in circles and riddles, because he's a weirdo. So, we would like for you to start the rolling, but B-U-T, first things first. B-U-T, first things first. Does the prince like vibration? Meaning the moving and the shaking? No, no, I hate it. Plain is best. I love going oh natural. If that's what you say, what you declare, then you can turn the vibration on and off with the back button on the controller. All clear? Yes, so good. We shall see you later. All right, so this is just the intro to show you how to use the controls. Very unique control scheme here because you're rolling around the ball. You got the two forwards to go forward. You got the two backwards. You can also break when you stop going in the opposite direction. You can go diagonals. You can shift left and right going up and down. You can do this and do a quick shift. And you can do so roll sideways left and right. So that's pretty cool. Lots of control over your ball. It's very nice. <clears throat> but wait, there's more. My, very princely indeed. Such skill and such class. Dazzling. We feel a swoon coming on. Next challenge is charge and roll, quick turn, look and jump. Careful, careful with the look and the jump. Not easy to do when you're rolling in a hurry. We shall see you later. All right, so the charge roll, very paramount to victory. We go super fast and it's very helpful. You just have to like alternate L and R and go fast. Uh, if you press LB, you can actually look around in first person to kind of aim yourself. And RB, I believe you can like jump to look up from the sky. So that's gonna be helpful if you need to sky view of something. And I guess one thing I totally forgot you could do, if you click both joysticks, you can quick turn flip around the other side of the ball. That's actually really helpful, which I didn't even remember you could do. So that's pretty cool, actually. Mastered it? Already? For real? Who are you? All shook up. All amazed. Indeed. Alright, let's watch this intro proper now. Oh god, he's coming right for us. Watch out! He might have destroyed a few stars on the way here, or wherever he's going. Alright, 
Bro, bro, bro. Honestly, I don't remember this intro to actually see, like, why... <laughs> Why we need to be creating stars, because that's the whole idea here, is we're creating stars and constellations via rolling things up. That's because the king just broke hella shit. Oops. No! It was indeed not a dream. We really did it! The king of all cosmos has really done it! A sky full of stars, and a pants full of junk. We broke it! Yes, we are- we were naughty. Completely naughty. So ve so very sorry. But just between you and us, it felt quite good, Art. Not that uh, we can remember very clearly, but we were in all nature's embrace. We felt the beauty of all things and felt love for all. That's how it was. Did you see? We smiled a genuine smile. Did you see? The stars splintering in perfect beauty. Also, this music. I'm enjoying it. Just bobbing my head to the beat. It's very catchy. So... Oh, so many there used to be, almost a nuisance. Now, there's nothing but darkness. He, tis but a dream. He, but a beautiful one. B, heart, U, heart, T, heart. That miraculous, fabulous moment has passed. It's over. We came to and found everyone furious. Even the king of all cosmos was not spared their wrath. Really, everybody was irate. So anyway, Pee-wee Prince, hurry up and bring back the glorious starry sky. Our problem, your problem, yes? <laughs> you us, owe us your existence. We collect on the debt, yes? Hand in hand, always there, yes? The very definition of the father-son bond, yes? All right then, get cracking. All right, thanks, Dad. Sending things to Earth, dot, dot, dot. Here we are, Earth. Full of things as usual. Hmm. Hmm? Ah, so, so, so small. You're as small as ever. We didn't notice. Not one jot. What, with the stars and all? What is that? That body? That physique? Could you really be our son? <laughs> I got it. Build yourself up while you roll the Katamari. Work out and get bigger. Yes, indeed. Don't presume to take the escalator up to the throne just because you're the prince. Woo, tangent. First time on Earth means no worrying about time. We think. We'll come and pick you up when you when that Katamari's 10 centimeters. Oh, oh just remember. Many things live here, scurrying around and gene generally getting in the way. When one of these things sneaks up behind you, an alert comes up on the lower left. You should try not to bump into anything alive. But don't worry about it too much. It won't end the game or anything, so just relax and roll. Good luck, Inchling Prince. All right, so the game begins, but first, I want to figure out if I can change some setting stuff, because holy moly. No, vibration on, please. I want vibration on, please. Uh, I don't think I can do any changes. So I'm going to try what DJ suggested and click Alt-Enter and see if I can do a full screen thing. Hold on. Alt-Enter. I don't think that works. There's got to be a settings thing so I can change settings, because this music is hella loud. And this screen is so small, and I want a bigger screen. I don't know if I have to go back to like a title screen now that I've actually started the game. But we may have to do the first level in a small window, unfortunately. Because it doesn't even have a thing where I can maximize my window. Like, what the hell? What the hell, Namco Bandai or whoever published this? What the hell? Alright, well anyway, let's just do this first level. Let's roll some shit up. We don't have a time limit on this one, so here we go. Oh boy. Sorry. Just trying to get used to how to control. I'll, my brain immediately wanted to turn the camera. But I'm pretty sure it always faces you forward, so. You just want to roll, roll, roll. I'm not going to read every line that the king says, because he talks a lot when you're doing stuff. He really does talk a lot. But make sure you roll all the things up, because you got to be 10 centimeters, he said he wants us to get to. We started off at 5, so yeah. Make sure you roll up all the things, and this is pretty much the gist of the game right here. Roll up all the thingy things. Walk the big bird icon, select... God damn it, DJ. Walk to the big bird icon, select the enter and display... That's all when you get into the menu, so I can't do that right now. So yeah, it's stuff I can't do unless I'm in the menu, which is not... This is not the menu, and I can't go to the menu until I at least do or quit out of the first level, I imagine. So, I'm gonna do that when I get a chance. 
I had a feeling I could change stuff. I just gotta do it, you know, on the right menu, I guess. Get that snail. Ooh, the snail, he fucked me up. Ah, the same thing. This is the very thing first we ever collided with. Yes, it is. The first snail you ever collided with. Yeah, you'll see. You'll see how to change stuff in a second, DJ. I, I already had a feeling I could do it in the menu, but the menu is in between levels, basically. I forgot this game kind of just throws you into the first level without like waiting for you to be ready, you know. You know, I'm trying to get up everything up on this table. I'm already almost 10 centimeters, by the way. He did say 10 centimeters, right? Oh, the fucking rat! You fucking rat! How dare you! Keep bumping into shit and losing my centimeters or my millimeters, man. Pretty sure as soon as we hit 10, this level's probably gonna end. Cause this is just like a practice level. How goes it, Prince? How's Earth? Huh? Huh? Oh, uh, you made a 10 centimeter katamari. Huh, how fabulous. We'd forgotten all about that. So you're mostly clear on everything, we assume. Everyone on Earth is very nice, so they'll be very helpful, yes? They'll let you roll everything up, with a smile, yes? Possibly also a wave. Anyway, let's go home for now. Oh, barfing rainbows! Gotta love it. Oh yes, almost forgot. Completely slipped the mind. When rolling on Earth, there are a few more things to be careful of. Oh yeah, what's that? You cannot roll up objects larger than your katamari. Crashing into larger objects and walls will break things off katamari and lose its eyes. We learned that the hard way already. No, don't you your tutorial again. 10 centimeters, huh? It was the very first goal, but it's not very exciting, is it? Next time we want a much bigger one. The thing that you collected the most of is... My, really, Earth really is full of useful, uh, full of things. So it actually tells you, like, the thing you collected the most, which in this case was necessities, snacks, and stationery. So there you go. We will now release it into the sky. So even though it's a little baby, first off, you know, little Katamari, it still counts. Gotta have a baby star in the sky to get started, am I right? Alright, so here we go. What? You forgot your own planet? Really? Are you serious? So you're not just too small, but a bit slow, too. As a parent, we cannot feel but partly responsible. Well, this is your home planet. The planet where you live. Here you can look at the stars, save the game, and do lots of other things. You can even visit Earth and the Space Mushroom just by pressing the L and R button. Roll your Katamari around on Earth. Visit the Space Mushroom to compete against your cousins. And that's about it, your smallness. Don't do get a grip, your absent-mindedness. Alright, please save the game at the home planet before quitting the game. If you quit without saving, it will not be saved. Okay, so you have to save manually, even in this version, huh? Alright, first things first, sound. This shit is loud. I don't know. I'm just gonna turn it down gonna turn it the fuck down everything is so loud i'll turn it back up in stream but it's so fucking loud in my ears and on the stream like holy shit shit it's probably still loud enough let me know if that's not loud enough anymore but it's still hella loud it doesn't save settings after you quit that's pretty annoying lucky for me i'm probably gonna try to beat this game all in one sitting so that's cool sounds all right okay cool all right usual controls all this is fine i just want to change display settings here we go there we go that's what i want right there give it to me daddy full screen window yes please those are the things i would like right there yes please okay let me fix it on the stream now and you guys will be all good fix it on the stream baby fix it on the stream fix it on the stream here we go now we got good graphicalness beautiful all right, we should be good now. In terms of graphics and sound, we should be beautiful. I can play full screen like I wanted, and we are good. Let me know if anything's too loud or whatever. But okay, so now that we have everything situated graphically and all that, I can stop being annoyed by having to play on a small screen, and I can enjoy the game properly. Presents. Yes, I read that as presents. It says presents, I know. So I haven't found any presents yet, big surprise. We've all we've done is the tutorial stuff. But um, yeah, so if you want to save it, you just click the save button and you make a new one. Booyah, we have a save file. No, don't quit. Uh, what do we got here? The collection, ooh. Size chart, locations, objects. 
So far, I've collected 1% of the things. I think this just keeps track of the types of objects you've collected, which is actually pretty cool. I don't know if that was in the original version. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what any of this is, really. Let's just do some levels, and then we'll worry about that. Um, anything else I can check out before we go on to the first level? I probably have already dilly-dallied enough on this screen, honestly. Let's go to the constellations. Oh, okay, this is just the actual constellations once you have them done. If you select one, it shows you what it was and what level it was for and all that. Okay, cool. Meteor control? Huh. Okay. Well, I guess if we want to do a level, we go to the house? No, wait, where do we go to do a level? Oh, do we do RB and LB, I guess? Okay, yeah, you press RB to go to this, and you pick a level. So we can remake a star level one, but I'm pretty sure this level doesn't do anything. There's nothing to do. It's just make a star to practice. It's essentially your, your uh, tutorial. So we're going to jump right into make a star number two. Y'all ready? Let's do Megan Dang Tang Holly Po. Have you ever been to the Philippines? We stopped in the day before yesterday. We hope you can visit during the day's rolling. Like that's possible. Oh yes. A royal present for the hardworking prince. That what well, that's what we were thinking. While playing catch with your present. And it went down to earth and just fell to earth. Must be around somewhere, so roll it up when you're at it, while you're at it. Alright, so these some of these levels got uh got presents. So we gotta try and get them. That doesn't look like the Philippines where the Philippines would be, but that's okay, I guess. It's not map accurate. It's really not, DJ. I wouldn't worry about it too much. But anyway, today we'll be rolling inside the house. The catamari should, let's see, be around a full twenty centimeters. We can believe in you for about seven minutes in Earth time. But any longer than that, and even the king of all cosmos can be can't be expected to wait. We look forward to a nice catamari, Mini Prince. Alright, so we got seven minutes to get to uh, 20 centimeters. So let's just roll it up, roll it up, roll it up, baby. I'm gonna roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it like a champion. Oh, you actually rolled the ants. That's awesome. Roll those ants. Oh, God, the rat! Ouchies! That rat came in hot, man. He was like, fuck your catamari. I'm gonna get that rat, don't you worry. That rat is gonna get my payback big time. Alright, we gotta keep moving though. We can't spend too much time. Dude, fucking rat! Ooh. Ooh, fucking rat. I was gonna say, we can't spend too much time grabbing every little thing, but sometimes you have to to get that catamari to build up, man. I guess those rats are just doing laps and I need to just get the fuck out of the way. Oh, and as you get bigger, the screen will kind of zoom out, so that's good. <clears throat> but yeah, this is pretty much the game. It's just chill, rolling, dope, you know, dope music playing. Rolling up frogs, don't mind me. So, yeah, they mentioned already there's a gift on every level. Uh, or at least, I don't know if it's on every single level, but there's on a lot of levels. There's a, there's a present you can actually roll up. I think if you actually roll it up, it'll tell you. It'll say, you rolled up the gift. Good job. So, again, I'm not going to promise I'm going to get 100% of everything in this playthrough. Can't promise that right now because I don't know where everything is at. But if I do it, you know, I'll do it. Apparently, I'm at 10 centimeters already, so that's cool. Just get it bigger. Yeah, yeah. Okay, Dad. I, I, I have to fight the urge to say you're not my dad because he is my dad. So Gotta fight that urge. You think a scamper is rolled up before it runs away? You got it, dude. Make sure you get all the Legos. I'm gonna kill this, 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 uh, the time, or what do you call it, the size on this one because I still have six minutes and I'm already past halfway to where I need to be. We're going to kill the time on this one. We're going to probably roll up everything in this fucking room. Chiggy don't. Chiggy don't, baby. Chigga, chigga, chigga. Can I get these tapes? Not quite. Oh, wait. Yes, I can. Give me those tapes. I like... One thing I really like about this is when you roll up something weirdly shaped. You can actually, like, roll up... Um, like, you roll weird. An oblong shape and stuff. It can get annoying, but it's also pretty accurate, which I like. Alright, let me I'm gonna go ahead and roll up all these scrimps and stuff. 
Shrimps and broccoli, delicious. Chiggy don't. Chiggy don't. Chiggy. Now I'm almost 20 centimeters already. And that's all I need to get to. I'm already there. Too easy. Oh, what a nice Katamari. Substantial, yet goes down smooth. But actually, we would love to have a much bigger, nicer Katamari. We'll leave you to wor your work then. So pretty much the rest of this is just how much more can you make it... How much bigger can you make your Katamari on the first level? Let's see what I can accomplish. Ooh, I would really, really like to roll up these fucking rats. Payback, bitch. Payback, bitch. I'm not big enough to roll up all these things yet. I need to be careful. I don't want to get stuck doing something I can't actually pick up yet, you know? Can I get this calculator? Hell yeah, I can. Get calculating calculator. I gotta get used to these controls, man. It's like, they're, they're so simple to understand, but you have to still kind of master how they work. All right, let's go out the door and start getting stuff outside, because we are well big enough to start picking up shit out here. Look at all the fun stuff out here we can roll up. Hell yeah, dude. We're going to be so big, it's going to be awesome. Give me those lollipop motherfuckers. Okay, I, I, I don't get stuck. Oh, crap. I don't want to get myself stuck underneath some shit, you know? I... I need to stop knocking shit off of my thing. Wow, I rolled up that plant and it's like not even attached to my shit right now. It's hilarious. I need to stop running into stuff. It knocks all my shit off. It's starting to annoy me. Chiggy don't. Funky don't. Roll up all the birds and all the fucking things. It's like as I get bigger, I can just kind of go around and do laps. Keep rolling up shit I already rolled up and roll up another round of it and more bigger. Damn, I'm already at three minutes. I need, to, I need to get more shit. Need to get all the shit. I feel like I'm just rolling past too many things. I, I, not on purpose. Just I got the present. I got the present. It was rolling around on top of something there, and I got it. Give me all the things. Chiggy Don, give me all the things. Chiggy Don, Chiggy Chiggy Don, on. I'm almost at 30. I feel like I should be past 30 by now, but I'm just wasting hell of time not rolling up shit. Come on, man. I want to be a bigger boy so I can roll up all the bigger things. There we go. Now it's feeling good. Yeah, it starts feeling good when it starts zooming out and you can start rolling up more shit. It's like, hell yeah. Hell yeah, dog. Give me this gnome bouncing around in his fucking boot like he's Mario 3 and shit. Yeah, roll those paint cans up that I fucked me up earlier. Hell yeah. Give me all the things. I'll take it. There's a big-ass person out here. I don't think I'm going to be able to grab them. I don't think we're going to get big enough on this level to actually pick up a whole fucking tall-ass person. One can hope, though. Kind of tempted to go back inside and see what we can roll up in there. pick up all the things up in here that I wasn't able to get before. Hell yeah, dog. I got one minute to pick up all the things. So one thing I haven't really mentioned yet about the, like, you can also get in this game besides the collecting the, of the presents, there's also the cousins or whatever. Like, I think that's what they're called. They're basically the main character's little cousins. You can collect them as well. There's supposedly one in every level. I don't know how big I need to be to get one in this level, or if I already got him. I don't think I got him. It would have probably said something. But, um... I don't know really how, how where he is or how big I have to be to get him. I probably wasn't big enough to get him, because I feel like I would have saw him. Dude, I can't roll up that fucking ledge? Come on, man. You're killing me. Anyway, I started off pretty strong on this level, but we, we definitely plateaued after we got past that 20 mark. Definitely didn't do as good as I would have liked, but still pretty decent, I would say. Still pretty decent. Still pretty decent. Time is up. It was boring to watch this whole time. We'll zip back to space now. Royal Rainbow Throw Up! Yeah! It was boring to watch. What an asshole. You're supposed to be my dad, homie. 
Anyway, 35 centimeters and 9 millimeters. We are moved to tears by the size of this thing. This is so incredible. Happy, happy, so happy. We want to turn it into a star right now. You did that that fast. You hit the goal awfully fast. That was fantastic. That was so speedy and so smart. It will be a shooting star like boom. Here, this is our royal present. Guess what? Guess what this is? I don't know. Is it a fucking... It looks like a snake. I don't know. It's a fucking... Is it a big... Is it a tube sock? I don't, I don't know. The thing that you collected the most of is... Apparently playtime items. Cool. My, Earth really is full of things. We will now release it into the sky. Hell yeah, you will. Alright, guys. We did it. Our first real level completed. I guess that's the... Oh. It's the messy star. Sure. Or did I do a messy job? I don't know. It's time to go, y'all. Hi! I miss the weird English voice acting. To be continued. I wonder if I can actually change it to the English voice acting. That would be hilarious. Something tells me I probably can't, but let's see. Yeah, all there is is the, the volume. So unless I can change it in, like, the, the setting settings, I'm going to guess I can't have the English audio. Let's see what my present was. Oh, it's a scarf. Adorable. Let's wear it. Yeah, I'm guessing you can't change it to... English, which is fine, whatever. The Japanese voice acting, I have never really heard it, so it's, it's fine. All right, well, we did our first level. You guys ready to do another one? Let's do another one. Good times. Let's make star number three. Uh, there's actually an extra level here, too, where we can make cancer. Would you guys want to make cancer? Let's make star number three first. <laughs> I don't know if I want to make a, a deadly uh, curse upon people. Boatarde! Have you ever been to Portugal? We were there yesterday. We hope you can visit during the day's rolling. Likes that's possible. Oh yes, almost forgot. Oh yes, a royal present for the hardworking prince. That's what we were thinking, and but we sort of tossed it down to earth. We had an issue and just sort of pitched it away. Must be around here somewhere, so roll it up when you, while you're at it. You got it, dude. Sending things to Earth. Let's roll them up. Today you'll be rolling around the town. The Katamari should be, let's see, around a sweet 50 centimeters. We can believe in you for 9 minutes in Earth time. But any longer than that, and even the King of All Cosmos can't be expected to wait. We look forward to a nice Katamari, loser prince. Damn, dad. What a dick. Alright, so our Katamari starts off a little bigger this time. We're at 10 centimeters. And we're going hard right off the bat. Here we go. Turn it. Okay. Going hard, y'all. The music goes hard. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Yeah, I'm surprised I didn't make that joke already myself, DJ. <laughs> or <laughs> rolling my way downtown. Walking fast. Rolling fast, rolling shit, and I'm homebound. Give me that butterfly, boy. Give me all the butterfly, boy. It always feels hilarious to grab things that are alive and just watch them squirm. Can't wait so we can grab humans and watch them flail. And we're already almost to 20 centimeters already, which is good shit. These jazzy tunes, man, they go hard. Can I get these croissants? Hell yeah, I can. Hell yeah, I can. Chris Hall. It's fun to try and like look at items and go, what the fuck is that? A lot of it's obvious stuff, like you know, toothbrushes, forks. It's like, what is that? Is that a cucumber? That's a cucumber, you know? Hilarious. Fun to kinda try and see what everything is. And shit, I guess for the sake of completion, there's a whole list of items that you can like try to fill out, try to grab every single type of item in the whole game. I didn't even know that existed until you know, today. I don't know if that was in the PS2 version or not. Because when I did play the PS2 version, I was playing it on my X, uh, no, my PS3, Xbox, what the hell? On my PS3, um, you know, via the PS2 emulation thing or whatever, but yeah. 
If it wasn't for the music, you'd lurk more, DJ. That's fair. But the music's too jazzy to ignore, am I right? It's too jazzy. How can you how can you not listen to it at the very least? It's so good. You don't even have to watch, just listen to the jazz. I didn't mean to fall down, but that's fine. We're almost at 30 centimeters, which means we're gonna be able to start picking up some new shit here in a second. Almost till you knock off a millimeter worth of shit. Get that. Get that fucking thing. Get it. Alright, we hit that 30 centimeter mark. And we're going. And yeah, this is definitely a DJ level of classic music. I know this is this is that jazzy shit you love, sir. I know. Like I know that Cuphead soundtrack soundtrack is right up your alley. And this is right in right in the same wheelhouse as that. In terms of musical. We need to get to how big again? 50 centimeters? We need to start moving a little faster then. Something's coming right for us. What is it? Must be that thing. I need to stop wasting my time with stuff that I can't roll up. Ah, the cat! Don't hurt me, cat. Cat almost ran me over. All right, here we go. Now we're picking up some speed and some, some size. Give me all the size. Give it to daddy. Give it to Katamari daddy. And look at me go, y'all. I'm rolling up all the things. It's beautiful. Oh, shit. Nice. We're at that 50 mark already. Let's go. Hell yeah, my Katamari is as big as one toy dispenser, y'all. What a nice Katamari. Kind of bratty, but kind of shy. But now that you've come this far, we would love to have a much bigger, super nice Katamari. We'll leave you to your work then. I'm okay with this. I got plenty of time to make this a beautiful thing, so let's just do it. Make sure you get fish. Don't forget the fish. Well, any and all things that can make us bigger. That's the kind of stuff you want to go for. It's like stuff that's literally going to make you bigger. Can't pick up that car yet, I don't think. But if you see something that's big, and you think you can get it, go for it. It'll make you that much bigger. Don't get stuck. Ah, uh, Don't get stuck. Ah, uh, the kitty's coming right for us. Uh, get those birds. Yeah! Take out food. We got birds, y'all. I can't pick up that cat yet. That's all right. We'll get there. Underwear. Under there. Can't roll over those planters yet. That's fine. I got to pick up that fence though. Hell yeah. I don't even think I've been up here yet. Yeah. Roll faster, dog. Oh god. Maybe too fast. Might have crashed my whole shit. I didn't want to do that. Kind of hard to believe I wasn't able to roll up that fucking pan. I know I'm knocking off the good stuff. I'm sorry, Mara. I'm not doing it on purpose. It's so easy to run into stuff, though. Goes around and around, y'all. All right, I'm looking for... I still haven't found the gift. Almost up to 70 centimeters, which is good shit. Hell yeah, baby. Yeah, I still haven't found the gift. Which is unfortunate. But we'll find it. We still got four minutes to roll up some shit, so... As long as I get bigger and bigger, we'll probably find the gift. Probably should have already found it, honestly, but... It could, have been, it could be anywhere, y'all. It could be rolling right by it. One thing that's tough, though, is once you get bigger, it's harder to spot said gift. Haha, I got the poopy! Roll, bitch. I'm gonna get that cat. Come here, cat. You still playing with me now, cat? I don't think so. Ha ha! Coming for your ass, boy! Ha ha! You can't flee from me forever! Ha 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 ha! I am victorious, kitty. You shall not have any more free run of this world. No, sir. Make sure we just grab everything at this point. Now we're getting big enough to start just grabbing anything I see. You know, that's in, that's in my size. Get those birds! They'll never be able to flee from me! Ha ha! 
Sandcastle? Oh, I can't pick up the Sandcastle yet. Not quite, not quite, not quite. We're probably close, but not quite. We're definitely getting pretty big, so this is good stuff. I don't know if there's any other side areas I haven't really checked out. I haven't been up here yet, I don't think. Damn it! Stop running shit over. Stop losing stuff. I'd like to get to 100 if I could, but I don't know if I'm going to make it if I can't find stuff big enough to get me there. Be lucky enough to get to 90 at this point. Damn it. I remember, I was only supposed to get to 50, so this is way better than I needed to be, you know? There we go. We got that 90. Good thing is it all becomes exponential once you get start picking shit up. You're just like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Rolled up a whole takoyaki fucking cooking thing. I still can't get that damn sandcastle. Which makes me sad. I'm running low on time, y'all. One minute. Man, sometimes you just get stuck on shit and you can't turn. Or you can't go up a little lip that you think you can. You're like, dude, what a, what a fucking waste of effort this is. Roll up all the things. I don't know what else to roll up, man. Kitty. Got the kitty. Heh <laughs> heh. I'm running low on time. Uh... Yeah, I got the sandcastle. Let's go. I never did get the gift. Oh, I lost the sandcastle because I'm stuck. I lost the sandcastle after I got it. I'm sad. Dude, why can't I roll up this? I keep running into it, but it won't let me roll up it. It's so annoying. I need to get better at these controls again, man. It's definitely a feel thing you gotta get used to. But anyway, we did it. We just remembered something we have to do. We're zipping back to space now. Royal Rainbow! Royal Rainbow. 92 centimeters and three millimeters. We are moved to tears by the size of this thing. This is so incredible. Happy, happy, so happy. We want to turn it into a star right now. You did that fast. You have to go awfully fast. That was fantastic. That was so speedy and so smart. It'll be a shooting star like boom! The thing that you collected the most of is cooking items, apparently. My Earth really is full of things. We will now release it into the sky. Alright. And that's another level down. I don't think I got the present on that one. I don't know where the hell it was at. But oh well. So far, not doing great on the collectibles, but that's okay. Right? To be continued. Story is just fucking weird. That's all I can say about that. Um, we didn't get any presents or anything cool like that, so let's just go straight on to doing another level, shall we? Alright, did we unlock a new level? We got Make Cancer, and we have Make a Star 4! You know what, let's take a little side venture and make cancer, shall we? Should be fun, right? What is it? Something's not quite there. Oh, yes, we get it. It just doesn't look delicious. This sky does not seem yummy at all. Everyone is still hungry, yes? Can't you see that, silly? Speaking of delicious, we say crab. Most certainly crab. Okay. So this is the one where we gotta get all crabs. That's the whole point. That's why it's called Cancer. We have to make the constellation of crab cancer. Don't make cancer, says DJ. Too late. Looks yummy. 
But no, no, not yet. Patience is a virtue. Focus. We must focus. To make the yummiest cancer possible. All you have to do is roll up as many, many, many crabs as you can find. Let's see. You have seven minutes. We look forward to a mouth-watering Katamari Kalo Prince. Oh, we look forward to a mouth-watering Katamari Kalo Prince. Sorry, so I read that very much not like I meant to. But anyway, get all the crabs. You still have to get bigger as you go, though, so you can actually pick up bigger crabs. But your goal here is to get all the crabs you can. I believe there's a there's a I don't think there's a crab counter, but you definitely want all the crabs. Crabs, crabs, crabs. Give me all the fucking crabs. Make sure you get all the things to make you bigger. Stop moving and yeah, get all those things. There you go. Ow. I need to stop moving so fast. Is what I need to do because every time I move too fast, I roll into shit. I knock some shit off and I'm mad. Give me all the crabs, yeah. Crab this, crab that, give me all the crabs. First it was cancer, now it's crabs. There is a crab counter over there, by the way, which I just noticed. It says 21 crabs so far. I like that every song has been different so far. I don't remember there being this many different tracks in the game, but holy crap. The songs are good stuff. So as I already mentioned, our size doesn't really matter on this level, other than the fact that we need to get bigger so we can get bigger crabs. So you definitely want to just keep getting bigger off of whatever objects you can get. And whatever crabs you find along the way, good shit. I'm glad we're big enough to pick up all these red crabs. I'm trying to pick up all these yellow ones, though. Give me all the red crabs, baby. Want all of your crabs. Give me all of your crab crabs, baby. I didn't mean to roll over that. What the hell, man? Hey, it's the pickle. He can finally watch a non-spoiler stream. Hey, isn't that nice? <laughs> this game is so weird, Donko. I agree. But it's good times. But hey, Pickle, thanks, man, for popping in and saying hi, and you can actually hang out for once. That's cool. I know, man, I'm always playing new shits. At least, I shouldn't say always, but lately, I've been playing nothing but new shit. But guess what? I'm done with all the new shit that I've been playing. Final Fantasy 16, done. T Tears of the Kingdom, done. I don't have any other new games lined up for a while, so... Time to play some old shit for a while, which I'm actually pretty excited about. I miss playing old stuff sometimes. Yes, give me all the crabs, boy. I shouldn't say sometimes. I miss it all the time. But, you know, sometimes you gotta wade through all the new stuff just to get back to your old stuff that you've been wanting to play, you know? I'm up to 70 crabs, man. I'm crab- I'm crab- I'm killing- I'm killer crabbing it right now, dog. I thought there was a bigger crab rolling around in here. Can I get this Stingray? Probably. I just had to murder it first. Oh, it was a horseshoe crab. That counts as a crab, apparently. All right. I don't even know if I knew that was a crab. Interesting. Killing the crab game, y'all. At this point, I gotta stop losing my crabs. Holy crap, I lost a couple crabs there. I wanna get up there. Can I get up there? If I roll up this thing? Yeah. No, slow down. Slow down. Go slower. There we go. Yeah. Give me that big old coconut green crab boy. Yeah. Let's get this big old green one over here and over here. There's a crab riding on that dog's back, which is adorably hilarious. There's some crabs up here on this wall. I kind of wish we were zoomed out a little bit more, but that's kind of the nature of the game, really. I don't know what else to roll up. Oh, I can roll up that t-shirt now. Nice. I'm running out of things I can roll up to get bigger, damn it. I want these fucking pans, but it won't give it to me. There's a crab on this pole. Come here, crab. How come the pole won't come down? Eh, yeah, whatever. 
Roger. I'll come back to that, I guess. What can I roll up to get bigger? Am I yoink that big old green crab? Give it. Give it all to me. Can I get that big crab out here now? He's moving around and shit, because I can probably get him now, that's why. I'll get this crab off the fucking... Come here, you big fucker. I murdered him, but I didn't pick him up. What the hell, man? Pick him up. Got his big ass. Yeah, spider crab. You're mine now, bitch. So here's the thing. Damn it. There's a way to get up here. Yeah. Here we go. I just gotta be careful about falling down. There's a bunch of crabs and shit up here, you know? Ah, get the dog! Yeah! I got the dog with the crab on his back. Get some. I'm up to a hundo, hundo two crabs, man. I feel like we're killing the cra crab game. I want this pole to roll by me. There we go. I got his ass. Alright, any crabs that I missed? There's one up here. I'm up to 102 crabs. There's some over here. Ah, dicks. Got a couple more crabs. Any more up here? Damn right there is. Give it to me. Oh, shit. Uh. I. I'm up to 30 seconds left. I've crabbed it up pretty good. I don't know how there's still crabs I haven't gotten that are like in this kind of area, but I think when you knock a crab off, they kind of go back to their original location if they can. I'm up to 109 crabs, y'all. Oh, I can't. I'm stuck on some shit, I guess. I don't know what's happening. Well, 109 crabs it is, I guess. Wee, that looks delicious, but also slightly disturbing. Well, yeah, it's fucking wiggle wobbling with a bunch of crabs in it. And a dog. Oh, well, let's take the yum yum rainbow back. Blah. Indeed. Borth. Too crab intensive and kind of gross. Apparently, I got 109 out of 81%. I don't know what that means. Does that mean I got 81% of the crabs out of all the crabs that were there? Anyway, what? 109 crabs? Fa fabulous! This is it! This is what we wanted! Crab, crab, a sea of crab meat. Crab heaven, this looks incredibly yummy! We are one step closer to the finest starry sky there is. Oops, we are drooling! Alrighty, let's just release it into the sky. Well, it seems like I did a decent job. Incredibly yummy cancer. Gotta love it. I'm assuming 81% means I did all, uh, only got 81% of the crabs. I don't know if, if that's true. But that feels like a lot of crabs I missed. Cancer came scuttling back, y'all. <laughs> so yummy! Who doesn't love a good crab? Alright, cool. We did it. Um, we didn't get any new gifts or homies or anything, so let's just keep going. <laughs> crab is best crab. Crab is best crab indeed. <laughs> we made a nice cancer. 